What's up everybody, welcome to a new video and today we will take a quick look on JTO because this coin is right now forming really really interesting trading setup in my opinion. So if you are interested about the exact trade that I'm planning to take here, of course if certain conditions are met, then definitely watch this video till the end. But before that I would like to ask you if you like my videos and you like my analysis. I will be really really happy if you hit that like and subscribe button and also if you type some comment under a video because it will simply help the algorithm to reach out my channel to a new people so yeah thank you guys for doing that and enjoy today's analysis but before that i would like to invite you to my discord trading group where i am sharing everyday crypto analysis on bitcoin and other altcoins that i'm currently watching so if you want to copy my exact trades or if you want to just follow my analysis you can join to this group and link to join is in the description or in the comments let's start today on a 12 hour chart you can see that right here we broke uh, this uh, this bullish triangle and after support confirmation we went to test this resistance area but this previous testing was just a liquidity grab we tested this previous resistance again and right now we are trying to break again this previous resistance i hope it's understandable so right now the main setup that i'm currently watching here will be valid in case of a breakout and then support confirmation as you can see we had here historically several fake outs so the support confirmation is like extremely important the exact trade can then look for example like this so stop loss you can put just under this resistance because as you can see historically every time there is a breakdown and resistance confirmation we are going down so you simply don't want to hold your losing position longer than it's necessary and as the last thing profit target well in my opinion you can really put it on the high level because uh, above this resistance area we historically don't have here that much liquidity so for the price it shouldn't be that big of a deal to reach the higher level so as my last take profit targets i would personally choose something let's say under seven dollar mark but definitely in this case multiple take multiple take profit targets so the potential risk reward ratio is around like 25 which is yeah like absolutely crazy with like six percent stop loss which is which is kind of safe but definitely in this case take multiple take profit targets so some of the profits take under this high then under this high this high and then for example under the under a five dollar mark six dollar mark and then you can save some back to the last take profit target and every time you for example after you will take for example the first take profit target you can move your stop loss to entry or to a break even so you can turn your profitable position into a loss and from the risk reward ratio 24 25 if you will take that many take profit targets which will make your trade much much safer you can have a risk reward ratio around like 18 17 something like that which is in my opinion like absolutely insane so yeah definitely keep an eye on this setup on the other hand, because this is like a really important resistance, it can also give us an opportunity to open here a short trade. But me personally, I'm not that big of a fan or this of this short trade because in this case, after a resistance confirmation, which might happen, you need to put your stop loss above this previous high because you can see that historically we had here several fake outs. So even if there will be that resistance confirmation, there is pretty high probability that we will just swipe the liquidity above. So the only let's say safe take profit can be above this previous week high but as my last take profit target i would choose in this case like uh, level 1.72 above above this previous uh, strong low so in this case you will have if you will take only like one take profit target the risk reward ratio will be like 2.34 which is in my opinion actually not that great so me personally i'm right now on the 12 hour chart watching only that long scenario because as i said that's in my opinion looking really really insane and compare it to the fact that right now we are starting to be in the bull market so opening a short position right now is uh, like not making that much sense and if we for example take a look on the four hour chart there is another opportunity that i would use to open a long trade and that will be in case of a resistance confirmation testing of this lower bullish order block which is between levels 2.17 and 1.9 so if there will be that uh, that support confirmation the exact trade can then look for example like this stop loss in this case you can put uh, under this uh, bullish order block or under the low that we will create during the fake out so if the market will do let's say for example something like this and then support confirmation then you need to put your stop loss under the low that we created during that fake out and as my last take profit target you can either choose like this resistance area which will make like kind of safe trade with risk reward ratio 5.4 which is really really good 
or you can always speculate for a higher returns and have like insane risk reward ratio so yeah that's another potential long that i'm currently watching here okay thank you everybody for watching this video if you liked my analysis and you want to copy my exact trades you can join my discord trading group where i am sharing my analysis and the coins that i'm watching every single day and link to join is in the description or in the comments but yeah guys this will be all for me for today thanks again for watching this video and i will see you in the next one see ya